Hello dear students, in our last class we discussed about linear programming problem and some of the definitions. Definition like objective function, optimization problem, constraints and feasible region as well as feasible solution. So in this class we are moving to the theory part of theory part of linear programming problem. So the first theorem is so the first theorem is let R let R be the feasible reason of a linear programming problem. Clear? So R is the feasible reason of the linear programming problem. So linear programming problem is feasible reason definition. So what is the definition? A common reason determined by all the constraints including non-negative constraints. So that reason is called here feasible reason. Okay. And I will take another one here. Z is equal to AX plus BY be an objective function. What is the objective function? So it will tell the aim or goal of the linear programming problem. Okay. So Z is equal to AX plus BY be an objective function. Where the variables X and Y or subject to the constants determined by or described by set of linear inequalities okay then z has optimal value what is the optimal value maximum or minimum clear optimal means here maximum or minimum so z has optimal value in or feasible reason and it must occurs at Okay, so in maximum or minimum value, it must occur at the corner point of the feasible reason. Corner point of the feasible reason. Explain what is the corner point. So here we have the here we have one constraint, another constraint. So what is the common reason? This reason in Burtala, this is called here feasible reason. Okay. So z is equal to ax plus by. This is an objective function. Then optimal value of this function is occurs at the corner points in Bartala boundary point. This is the point of intersection of boundary lines. Bartala, these are cancel. So this optimal value must occur at corner point of the feasible reason. Okay, statement please. Okay. In the statement, let R be the feasible region. Convex bracket line them convex polygon. What is convex polygon? In a polygon only, so when they do point on the, when you take the two points, the line segment joining these two points must completely occur in or must completely lies in that polygon. That is called here convex polygon. Okay, listen here. Let R be the feasible region for a linear programming problem and Z is equal to AX plus BY be the objective function when Z has optimal value. Optimal means here maximum or minimum value where the variables x and y are subject to the constraints described by linear inequalities this optimal value must occur at corner points of the feasible region must occur at occurs at corner point of the feasible region this has been clear okay next theorem 2 so theorem 2 again is very simple here we have the feasible reason this is the feasible reason and these are the corner points. This is feasible reason and these are the corner points. So and z is equal to ax plus by. We already defined here z is equal to ax plus by. Be an objective function. Be an objective function. Suppose this reason is bounded. Clear? It is bounded as definite boundary. So when this reason is bounded, then Z has the objective function has both maxima or minimum value. It has both maximum as well as minimum value. And these value, maxima or minimum value, must occur at corner point of the feasible reason. Clear? Corner point of the feasible reason or this is I'll take this reason as here or statement, please. Okay, not let R be the feasible reason for a linear programming problem and z is equal to ax plus by be the objective function clear z is equal to ax plus by be the objective function if r is bounded r is bounded means here this reason is the feasible reason is bounded because it has definite boundary 
then objective function z as both a maximum or a minimum value clear z as both maximum or minimum value on or on or means here feasible reason and each of these occurs at corner point of or corner point of the feasible reason this is the case still observe the word here bounded is so okay sir still bounded is any no problem suppose unbounded is again more bodu so we have some remark there clear we have some remark suppose this reason is unbounded unbounded andre so it is in moving infinitely it has extension of infinite extension irutte ee tar irutte so this is your reason ili corner points ide suppose the reason is unbounded then objective function may not have may not have objective function may not have optimal value or maximum or minimum value if it exist the occurs at the corner point of feasible reason clear feasible reason it may be bounded or it may be unbounded in both the cases maximum or minimum value may occur when it is bounded reason there is not a problem when it is unbounded the object when it is unbounded optimal solution optimal value may not exist suppose if it exists there occurs at corner point of the feasible reason okay we have the remark remark please and notice if r is unbounded reason suppose r is here unbounded reason then a maximum or minimum value have value of the objective function may not exist may not exist if it exist it must occur at the corner point of the feasible reason clear it is a case for unbounded reason so most of the case in example kelthu you know, bounded reason kelthar clear okay next one in it okay so next here the steps to solve lpp by graphical method nodi linear programming problem na solve madudu graphical method solve madti so what are the important steps okay first one first time madbeku we need to find find the feasible region of the linear programming problem and determine its corner points so feasible region thondi first we need to find your feasible region and determine its corner points okay these are the corner points illa nanu thondirudu bounded region thondidu clear so next second step second step alli we need to find the values of objective function z the values of objective function z at corner point second point the evaluate the objective function at corner point i will take here m is the largest value clear m is the largest value and m is the smallest value of these points okay so e corner point bandaga we take the point as x and y substitute in the objective function z is equal to ax plus by among the values the largest value take here capital m and smallest value have taken small m okay next time what do third step when this feasible region is bounded nodi so theorem 2 alli helide so when this region is bounded then the largest value em irutalo m this become the maximum value clear this become maximum value suppose small m irutalo this become minimum value clear this become minimum value so capital m become the maximum and the small m become here minimum when this re reason is here bounded clear this reason is bounded reason okay so i to sir so bounded reason idage eno problem what about unbounded reason for both bounded reason as well as the unbounded reason first and two first and second steps are very important so we, these two follows the same step so when comes to third step so this is the feasible reason it is not a problem what about unbounded reason we have the next step here we have to carry another step steps next step so when feasible reason is unbounded clear when feasible reason unbounded avaga again martini when feasible reason is here unbounded m suppose i take here m is the maximum value of z clear m is the maximum value of z if we have the condition if m that is a open off plane determined by 
the inequality a x plus b y greater than m clear a x plus b y greater than m so this open off plane this open off plane has no point in common with the feasible reason in common with the feasible reason so pay nodi illondo this is the feasible reason this is a feasible reason so nodi ax plus by greater than m anta this is the strict inequality follow dotted line so it will burut okay this is the reason p kara burut antu okay so when this reason does not have or have not any point common with the feasible reason but ill common point ide adike en martini so this remove maadi suppose i'll take this as here okay ee kade baruthu tilkodu this is the reason okay this is the reason determined by the linear inequality ax plus by greater than m suppose this off plane have not or has no point common with the feasible reason then m become the maximum value suppose this reason ee kade bare bodlu ee kade itandre have the common point in that case the maximum value of z does not exist there or z has no maximum value is it clear so nodi ee problem na nu exam ee theory em enide alva so i'll explain in the one problem all in clarity agutte okay next so what about minimum so minimum for the same case avage en martivi andre so we take in the open off plane that is here ax plus by less than m clear ax plus by less than m so the open of plane ax plus by less than m has no point common with feasible reason has no common has no point in common with the feasible reason clear in that case m become the minimum value okay suppose this open of plane end baruttalo open of plane so suppose ee kade ide has the common point with the feasible reason in that case z has no minimum value clear z has no minimum value okay now the theorem 1 and theorem 2 and important steps for finding the solution of linear programming problem so we have one flow chart flow chart please first and foremost step is here please zoom in okay first step is finding the feasible reason okay so using the given linear inequality first you have to find out the feasible reason okay second step find the value of z that is your objective function ittalwa find the value of objective function at corner points third one so alli en martivi the largest one now capital m anta consider martini smallest one na small m anta consider martini next next is very important here the reason it may be bounded or unbounded okay reason it may be bounded or unbounded first bounded bage discuss madana so when the r is bounded next m become the maximum value that is capital m become or largest value become maximum value and small m become minimum value of the objective function clear and four most important step is here when it is unbounded when it is unbounded we have okay so when it is unbounded suppose i will take here capital m as the maximum value so largest value baruthe adana maximum value anta consider martini so eva consider madbeku provided we have the condition when the o first draw the plane p ax plus b by greater than m so idana plane draw martini after the drawing the plane next p has no common point with r andre so open of plane have no common point with the feasible reason then m become the maximum value clear m become the maximum value next p has the common point with r suppose now yen bartalo open off plane has the common point with feasible reason then z has no maximum value the objective function has no maximum value clear okay next suppose idu maximum aitu what about minimum so avaga en martandre again we draw the plane off plane p such that ax plus by less than m ili p denote the here off plane ax plus by less than m okay in that case we have the two cases so this open off plane has common point with the feasible reason and has no common point with the feasible reason so when next one suppose p has no common points clear andre open off plane 
has no common point with the feasible reason then small m become the minimum value clear the small m become the minimum value of the objective function next suppose p has common point with feasible reason okay p has common point with the feasible reason is here open of plane determined by the inequality ax plus by less than m has common point with the feasible reason in that case z has no minimum value next slide z has no minimum value so is it clear mukla no these are the important steps we must follow while solving linear programming problem nodi nim exam alli most of the cases kelodu bounded reason keltare so bounded reason kelda gen madbeku take the largest value as maximum and least value as the or smallest value as the minimum value of the objective function is it clear okay so second endige unbounded reason ide idinella thagondu one pause madkondu complete note kodi you will get the complete things about the method to solve linear programming problem by graphical method is it clear okay nextly we discuss about some important problems they are the worked examples so first problem i discuss martini bounded reason bage discuss martini clear second problem unbounded reason bage discuss martini so first bounded reason bage discuss madbekare so yen follow madbeku okay now dear students look look at the first problem solve the following linear programming problem graphically maximize z is equal to 4x plus y subject to the constants they given the constants here x plus y less than or equal to 50 3x plus y less than or equal to 90 and x greater than or equal to 0 and y greater than or equal to 0 so these two nothing but they are non negative constants so this is a non verbal problem endre so direct problem kodirtare so optimization problem that is objective function and constants kodirtare using the constants we have to maximize or minimize the objective function okay so first problem in discuss madodalla that is a verbal problem alle en martu andre first we convert the entire problem to mathematical form okay so then we can go with the procedure so but illi enide directly kodidare so maximize the objective function z is equal to 4x plus y subject to the constraints x plus y less than or equal to 50 and 3x plus y less than or equal to 90 and x greater than or equal to 0 and y greater than or equal to 0 so ee problem already discuss madidivi okay solution so first write the constants given so constants ende barkonana x plus y less than or equal to 50 and 3x plus y less than or equal to 90 And x greater than equal to zero, y greater than equal to zero. So please give the blank space. Okay. Now listen. So then, how to solve this question? So first find the feasible region. First time for that, one by one, we have feasible region. Okay. Right. The equations involved in the inequalities. This or reason. So first we will consider what is next. So what are the equation involving here? First one x plus y is equal to 50. Clear. And the second one 3x plus y is equal to 90. Okay. So now find the points on x axis and y axis. So now put x is equal to zero. Put x is equal to zero. So what we left there here? Y is equal to what? Then we get 50. What is the point then? Zero comma fifty. Clear? Zero comma fifty eight. What is the second point? Now put y is equal to zero. You get the point on which axis? X axis. X become fifty. Clear? X is equal to fifty. So what is the point then? Fifty comma zero. Clear? But what about three x plus y? Then? Okay. So put x is equal to zero. You get the point on y axis. Now put y is equal to zero. Then you get the point on x axis. Okay. Now put x is equal to zero. So y is equal to what here? Ninety. Y and bandha panamge ninety. Similarly, put the point zero comma ninety. So now put y is equal to zero. While substituting y is equal to zero, so three x and agathe three x is equal to ninety. X become thirty. So the corresponding point thirty comma zero. 
So, equation 3x plus y is equal to 90. The first point here is 0, 90. This is the point on y axis. Similarly, 30, 0. This is the point on x axis. Then what is the next step? Next step we have to find whether the solution region is towards origin or away from the origin. For that purpose, I will go with here. So, take the first inequality. First inequality in the x plus y. Now, x plus y less than or equal to 15 x plus y less than or equal to 50 so put x comma y is equal to 0 comma 0 so put x is equal to 0 and y is equal to 0 0 plus 0 less than or equal to 50 clear in either 0 plus 0 and 0 less than or equal to 50 so obviously 0 less than or equal to 50 means here the given inequality is true so it's obviously 0 is less than 50 agathalo. So 0 is less than or equal to 50. So this is here true. Solution this reason is towards origin. Solution reason is towards origin. Similarly, we have to check for the second one. What is the second inequality here? 3x plus y less than or equal to follow the same method. So 3x plus y less than equal to 90 similarly for put x comma y is equal to 0 comma 0 clear put x comma y is equal to 0 comma 0 next 10 agate not on so that is 3 into substitute x is equal to 0 and y is equal to 0 so what we obtained here 3 into 0 is 0 plus again 0 less than equal to 90 this is nothing but 0 less than equal to 90 so obviously 0 is less than 90 so this inequality is true Hence, the solution reason, and the solution reason is towards origin. Solution reason is towards origin. See here. So one part of the problem is clear. In Andre. So we are finding the points on x as well as the y axis. Then we are finding here solution reason whether towards origin or not. Clear? Okay. So next we draw the free, next we draw the graph. So graph not draw model. Next slide. Next. Okay. So what are the points here? Okay. So points I want to know. Points here for the equation x plus y is equal to 50. We get to the point here 0, 50 and 50, 0. And for 3x plus y is equal to 90. Point here 0, 90 and 30, 0. And remember both the solution reasons for these two inequality. What is the inequality in them get? x plus y less than or equal to 50 as well as 3x plus y less than or equal to 90. For both the inequalities, solution reasons are towards origin clear solution reasons are towards origin so now draw the graph now dear students draw the graph okay so first point is not first equation here x plus y is equal to 50 there and the corresponding point on y y axis as well as x axis first point on 0 comma 50 so we get the 0 comma 50 here this is the point 0 comma 50 and another point 50 comma 0 so 50 comma 0 is point on which axis here x axis this is the point Okay, so now we join these two points. So join more than we have the line. No? We get here this line. Okay, this is the line. Corresponding equation. What is the equation here? X plus y is equal to 50. X plus y is equal to 50. Okay. Then so what about second line? 3x plus y is equal to 90. There so corresponding points in the 0, 90 and 30, 0. 0, 90, this is the point on which axis here? Y axis. See here? 0, 90. And second point, 30, 0. This is on which axis here? X axis. So join these two points. We have point and join Martin. So we will join these two points. Corresponding equation in Agatha Panamge. This is equation here 3x plus y is equal to 90. 3x plus y is equal to 90. So now observe here. 
So inequality solve mode by kare. Well, substituting x is equal to zero and y is equal to zero in the inequality x plus y less than equal to fifty and three x plus y less than equal to ninety. In that case, the solution is an R towards origin. Clear? Solution is an R towards origin. So this is the line. This towards origin. Similarly for this one, line baru talwa. X plus y less than equal to fifty. This become towards origin. Adun draw mardin. First towards origin. At the arm at towards origin. For the second one, second one, we then have line three x plus y. That is also towards origin. Is there another one? Again, we have non-negative constants. That is x greater than equal to zero and y greater than equal to zero. The first two x greater than equal to zero. Draw more. X greater than equal to zero means here right to the origin. Clear? Right to the origin. इधर बोलते हैं लाइंस, राइट टू द ऑरिजन। सो व्हाट अबाउट वाई ग्रेटर एन इक्वल जीरो, दैट इज एबोव द ऑरिजन। इधर बोलते हैं एबोव द ऑरिजन। क्लियर? एबोव द ऑरिजन। सो इवन इन मतलब कितने? यर मीट टू फाइंड द फीजिबल रीजन। फीजिबल रीजन बाकी डेफिनेशन है इधर। व्हाट इज द फीजिबल रीजन? द कॉमन रीजन डि� all the constants including non negative constants clear so what is the reason which satisfy all the conditions here we have the reason this reason lenidella so reason already ili x plus y less than equal to 50 satisfies again 3x plus y less than equal to 90 that is also satisfies y greater than equal to 0 that is also satisfies and x greater than equal to 0 that is also satisfies so which is the reason this reason This reason is feasible reason. Clear? This reason is feasible reason. No, this reason is called what we feasible reason. I marking here. This is the reason. Okay. So this reason what we call as a feasible reason. No, so feasible reason observe more the gutta gutte. This reason is here bounded. Clear? We have the definite. Boundary. Okay. So theorem number two is that when the feasible reason is bounded, then uh, Z has both maximum as well as minimum value. Z has both maximum as well as minimum value, and these values are occur at what is the point here? Corner point of the feasible reason, right? So these values are occur at corner point of the feasible reason. So corner point denote Martin. So these are the four corner point of the feasible reason okay so first point i thought this is the point here a so corresponding point in the point okay 30 comma zero okay clear 30 comma zero second point b now here we need to for this is the point of intersection of the line 3x plus y is equal to 90 and x plus y is equal to 50 clear so this is the point of intersection of the line x 3x plus y is equal to 90 and x plus y is equal to 50 clear so what about another point here another point i will take this as here point c this is the point on which axis y axis corresponding point here 0 comma 50 0 comma 50 clear so these are the corner point and we have another one here origin so the corresponding point here 0 comma 0 so next is we need to find the point b so B in point of this is nothing but the point of intersection of the line 3x plus y is equal to 90 and x plus y is equal to 50. So give the bank space. Okay. Then how to solve this equation? First write the equation, equation for Kunana. So what is the equation? Equation is here x plus y is equal to 15 another equation 3x plus y is equal to 90 solve this <coughs> here the equations are x plus y is equal to 50 and 3x plus y is equal to 90 so these two are here linear simultaneous equation how to solve this kind of equation so we have three methods first method by substitution and then substitute x in terms of y or y in terms of x okay and the second method is here by cancellation cancellation means either we have to cancel x term or y term and the third method is here cross multiplication okay so i will choose second method 
that method is your cancellation method so canceling martir nevu so either we have to cancel x term or y term nodi x term cancel madbekare we have to equate the coefficient of x similarly y terms cancel madbekare equate the coefficient of y okay illu nodi i'll cancel here x term what is the coefficient of x here 3 ide so here x coefficient is here 1 so adike multiply this equation by 3 so this become 3x plus 3y is equal to 150 <coughs> Okay, write this equation here. This become 3x plus y is equal to 90. Now change the sign. This become minus. Okay, what about this one? Minus. This is also minus because change the alternate side. Plus is minus. Minus is plus. Okay. So plus 3x and minus 3x get cancelled. We left with here 0. Clear? Plus. What is the term here? 3y minus y 2y. Clear? Okay. Next step. So 150 minus 90. That becomes 60. Okay. So therefore y is equal to 60 divided by 2. The value is here 30. So once y value is 30, what about x here? Substitute this equation. x plus y is equal to what we are? 50. So what is x become? x is equal to 50 minus y. Substitute the value of x. What is x value here? So substitute the values of y here. What is the value of y? 30. That become 50 minus 30. X value is here 20. Therefore, the point B is here. X value is 20 and the y value is here 30. That become 20 comma 30. Okay. So we have four corner point. First one here 0 comma 0, 0 comma 50, 20 comma 30 and 30 comma 0 clear these are the corner points and this region is called feasible region you know feasible region very big feasible region the shaded portion name but this region is called feasible region okay so after opening the feasible what is the next method we have to find the value of objective function at corner point we need to find value of objective function at corner point and then find out more Okay. Next, next slide. Next. So here O A B C is the feasible region. O A B C. This region is called here feasible region. Next. So what are the corner points here? Corner point in is not on. O is here 0, 0, A 30, 0, and B 20, 30, and C is here. 0 comma 50 okay so next we need to find here value of objective function at corner point next slide <coughs> the, the value of objective function at corner points r okay so here we have the table corner points and here z is equal to 4x plus y they are the values of z is equal to 4x plus y is objective function so for first point o of 0 comma 0 so put x is equal to 0 and y is equal to 0 so we get here z is equal to 0 okay then a of 30 comma 0 that become 4 3 is 12 that is 120 plus 0 is 120 so when is b is here 20 comma 30 put x is equal to 20 and y is equal to 30 we get the value 110 clear similarly for point c c any the point to 0 comma 50 there. substitute x is equal to 0 and y is equal to 50 we get the value of z optimal the value of z is here 50 just observe the value of z so next time for not here we need to find the maximum value so which is the maximum value here or a largest value what is the largest value 120 okay so 120 is the largest value among these value so because the feasible reason is bounded we conclude that 120 is the maximum value of the given objective function z is equal to 4x plus y at the point of corresponding point here 30 comma 0 next okay therefore hence the maximum value of z is 120 at the point 30 comma 0 so this is the method to find the value or optimal value of the given objective function so when the reason is bounded so illian martivi the concept is very simple. So first find the feasible reason. So feasible reason for not 
then find the corner point so corner point admele check whether the region is here bounded or unbounded so region is bounded then find the value of objective function at each corner point so after finding the corner point next method is find the largest and smallest illa me beka the largest because we need to find the maximum value of the objective function okay that largest value become maximum because the region is bounded okay suppose whatever the region is unbounded we have to carry out one more step okay carry out one more step clear so this is the method to solve object to solve linear programming problem by graphical method now dear student we discuss about the second problem and here we already discussed so first problem en baruthe namge feasible region is bounded second problem en baruthe appo namge feasible region is unbounded so idini yav tara solve madodu for the first problem we need solve madodu la for when the feasible region is bounded so first step alli em martivi you find the feasible region and second step alli take the largest term smallest value the region is bounded not a problem so when the region is unbounded we have to carry one more step okay so then yav tara solve madu ivaga nodana nodi problem nodi enide so determine graphically the minimum value of objective function z is equal to minus 50x plus 10y clear subject to the constraints what are the constraints 2x minus y greater than equal to minus 5 and second 3x plus y greater than equal to 3 third one 2x minus 3y greater less than equal to 12 and the last two constants are x greater than equal to 0 and y greater than equal to 0 they are nothing but non negative constants first constant work on thing first three constant given okay first time they open them here 2x minus y greater than equal to minus 5 okay next 3x plus y less than equal to 3 sorry greater than equal to there greater than equal to 3 third one 2x minus 3y less than equal to 12 less than equal to 12 okay so follow the same method and is live and solid ankle the role for linear inequality we follow the same method okay blank space please okay so first time what we write the equation involving the given inequalities are okay equations involved in the given inequality inequalities or for the equation first one is you know, 2x minus y greater than equal to minus 5 so equation work of equal one take this as here equal second equation 3x plus y is equal to what 3 third equation 2x minus 3y is equal to 12 okay so now same follow the same method put x is equal to 0 we get the point on y axis put y is equal to 0 we get the point on x axis okay first point so put x is equal to 0 come here put the pump minus y is equal to minus 5 minus minus get cancelled what will left there y is equal to what 5 so corresponding point become 0 comma 5 clear okay now substitute put y is equal to 0 we get the point on x axis how again i say 2x is equal to minus 5 and corresponding point here x is equal to minus 5 divided by 2 value of x is here minus 5 divided by 2 agat corresponding point minus 5 divided by 2 comma 0 clear come to the second equation follow the same method substitute x is equal to 0 put x is equal to 0 we get y is equal to y is equal to so x is equal to 0 means here 3 into 0 becomes 0 and y value become here 3 corresponding point 0 comma 3 okay so now put y is equal to 0 when I substitute y is equal to 0 we get the when y is equal to 0 3x is equal to 3 what is the values of x here x is equal to 1 agatha. corresponding point here 1 comma 0 is it clear okay third one third equation I need third equation is here 2x minus 3y 
is equal to 12. 2x minus 3y is equal to 12. I will write here 2x minus 3y is equal to 12. Okay. So now put x is equal to 0. x is equal to 0 substitute maridini. So again, but tamge, minus 3y is equal to 12. So what is y then? y is equal to 12 divided by minus 3. We will have to here minus 4. 3 ones are 3 fours are get cancelled. Okay, corresponding point in Agatha Nodi. X is here 0 and Y minus 4. Clear? Okay, next. So now put Y is equal to 0. Nodi. 3 into 0 and Agatha Panamke, 0 birth. Remaining again with the terms only 2X is equal to 12. So 2X is equal to 12 means here X is equal to 12 divided by 2. That become 6. Okay. Then corresponding point here. X is equal to 6 and Y is equal to 0. Point in the point 6 comma 0. Good. Clear 6 comma 0. Okay. What is the next step? Next step we have to check whether the solution reason for the given inequalities are included origin or not or towards origin or not. So for that purpose take all the inequalities. Now take all the inequalities. Now first one is the 2x minus y greater than or equal to 5. 2x minus y greater than or equal to 5. Sometimes you put x is equal to 0 and y is equal to 0. Put x comma y is equal to 0 comma 0. So 2 into 0 minus 0 greater than or equal to 5. So this is minus 5. 2 into 0 is 0 minus 0 greater than or equal to minus 5. See what I get 0 greater than or equal to minus 5. This is 0 is greater than or equal to minus 5. Obviously, this inequality is true. True, Agatha. Therefore, what is the solution reason? Solution reason is towards what? Origin. Therefore, solution reason. is towards what origin towards origin okay next time consider for second one second inequality consider martin second inequality is here 3x plus y greater than equal to 3 clear 3x plus y greater than equal to 3 so now put x comma y is equal to 0 comma 0 it means here put x is equal to 0 and y is equal to 0 in the given inequality 3 into 0 plus 0 greater than or equal to 3 so 3 into 0 nothing but 0 plus 0 like greater than or equal to 3 clear 0 greater than or equal to 3 you know 0 greater than or equal to 3 and this it means here false Okay, this inequality is false. Then solution reason. Solution reason Solution reason is away from the origin. Clear? Solution reason is away from the origin because inequality is here false. Okay. Solution reason is away from the origin. Not from or the origin. Okay. Third one. Third one is very important. Any then 2x minus 3y less than equal to 12. For the same method, put x comma y is equal to 0 comma 0. Clear? Any substitute more Put x comma y is equal to 0 comma 0. That is 2 into 0 minus 3 into 0 less than equal to 12. Okay. 2 into 0 nothing but 0 minus 0 less than equal to 12. Again, 0 less than equal to 12. Obviously, 0 is less than 12. This inequality is here true. Solution reason, I repeat, solution reason is towards origin. Solution reason is towards origin. Towards origin. So, next step we need to find the graph. See the L inequality in a graph will draw Martin. So first inequality is here towards origin. And for the second one, away from the origin. For the third one, towards origin. Okay. Now the graph will draw Martin. Okay. Next slide.
Wait, wait, wait. Oh, next slide. Okay. Come to the slide. Next. Stop. Okay. Here, for the first corresponding point, the solution reason is towards origin. For the second one, 3x plus y is equal to 3 and the corresponding point could be there and solution reason is away from the origin for third one follow the same year the solution reason is towards origin the okay, graph so now dear students draw the graph okay first first equation is 2x minus y is equal to minus 5 there so corresponding point here 0 comma 5 and another point minus 5 by 2 comma 0 so what is 0 comma 5 this is a point on which axis y axis in a point 0 comma 5 so corresponding another point is here minus 5 by 2 comma 0 minus 5 by 2 and right towards negative direction of x axis in birtha 2.5 5 by 2 nothing but 2.5 so minus 2.5 by 2 so join these two point you know, point and join more thing and I will extend to this line here. Okay. Corresponding equation in the problem. Corresponding equation is here 2x minus y is equal to minus 5. Clear? Okay. So, what about the solution reason is towards origin? Okay. Towards origin means here this is the type. E towards origin. Write the arrow mark towards origin. Come to the second equation. <laughs> second equation only. Second equation is 3x plus y is equal to 3. <coughs> Corresponding equation is here 0, 3 and 1, 0. So 0, 3, this is the point on which axis is y axis. This is the point here 0, 3. Another point here for the same equation 1, 0. This is the point 1, 0. So join these two points. This point is join Martin. Here. And the corresponding equation or the equation here 3x plus y is equal to any the problem 3. Clear? So, what about solution reason? When I substitute x is equal to 0 and y is equal to 0, the given inequality for this equation become false. That's why the solution reason is away from the origin. So, the solution reason is away from the origin. So, this is towards origin, away from the origin or opposite to the origin. So, draw the plane. See the drama or not? Okay. Aramark Borde. So now consider for third equation 2x minus y is equal to 12. Okay. Corresponding points are 0, minus 4, 0, minus 4 in Burta on negative direction of y axis. Next point here 6, 0 is a point. So join these two points. And extend. And the corresponding equation in the equation Brena 2x minus 3y is equal to 12. Clear? 3, 2x minus 3y is equal to 12. Okay. So next thing up the solution reason is towards origin. Towards origin arrow mark breathing. So illegal complete item. No, we have to follow another one because x is greater than equal to 0 and y greater than equal to 0 they are non negative constants okay so then draw more thing so for right to the origin become x greater than equal to 0 okay above the origin become y greater than equal to 0 okay so now determine the feasible reason okay what is the feasible reason already discussed Madhini. feasible reason is nothing but the common reason determined by all the constraints all the constraints including non-negative constraints that reason is called feasible reason that reason is what we call is a feasible reason feasible reason now but not enough so if you consider for all this run this reason would be x greater than equal to zero this is not a feasible reason this is also not a feasible reason because all the constraints are has been satisfied in this reason. This is the reason. Okay. So this reason is called feasible reason. Okay. This reason is called feasible reason. Okay.
So what we call this reason as feasible reason. Okay. This is the feasible reason. I think. Right. This is here. All right. Here feasible reason. So once you obtain the feasible reason, what is the next method? Find the corner points. Okay. Corner point for it. Here we have one point. So here we have another point and we have another point and here we have the another point. So total we have here four points. But the first point here, I will take this is the point A. X axis is there, so six comma zero. But the low point is six comma zero. Okay. Another point. A point in the B and the consider model B of one comma zero. Here we have another point. I will take this as here C. Corresponding point here 0, 3 because it is in y axis. Similarly, point, point D is no, no. all right here. D of what is the corresponding point here 0, 5. Okay. So, after finding the corner point, what is the next method? Find the value of the objective function at corner point. Four corner points. Next step, find out the value of the objective function at corner point. Okay. Find out the next slide. Okay. What are the corner points here? A of 6, 0, B of 1, 0, C of 0, 3 and D of 0, 5. Okay. Next. The value of the objective function at corner points. Value of the objective function at corner points. Okay. These are the corner points and corresponding value of objective function. So Z is equal to minus 50X plus 20Y. So when X is equal to 6, the value becomes minus 300. When and so for second point one comma zero put x is equal to one and y is equal to zero you will get minus fifty and third one c of zero comma three put x is equal to zero and y is equal to three we are in the point sixty and d of zero comma five what is the value of objective function hundred okay so we have found we need to find the minimum value so now consider the least value what is the smallest value or least value here we have minus three hundred minus 300 so minus 300 is mele. so because the feasible reason is here unbounded it is not a bounded so when we have the unbounded reason we have to carry one more step here we need to find the minimum value of the objective function okay so minimum value of the objective function in Agathandre. next we have to draw the open off plane which is determined by the inequality minus 50x plus 20y is less than minus 300 so because the feasible reason is unbounded okay next slide okay so now draw the open off plane minus 50x plus 20y less than minus 300 either. okay so follow the same method take the point on x axis by substituting y is equal to 0, similarly substitute x is equal to 0, we get the point on y axis. Okay. Inequality in the first problem, inequality is here minus 50x plus 20y less than th minus 300. Minus 50x plus 20y less than minus 300. Blank space, blank space for this. Okay, so now solve this inequality. This is the same method. Take the equation involving the this inequality. Equation involved in the inequality is in the panamga minus 50x plus 20y is equal to minus 300. Clear it become minus 300. So now put x is equal to 0. So what is the, what we left here? 20y is equal to minus 300. Okay. So what about y then which implies? 0, 0 get cancelled. 2 1s are 2 15s. Are. So y is equal to minus 15. Y is equal to what is the here? Minus 15. Okay. Corresponding point here 0, comma minus 15. Now substitute y is equal to 0, we get minus 50x is equal to minus 300. After simplification here, minus and minus get cancelled, 5 1s are 5 6s are. Therefore, 
x value become x is equal to 6. What is the corresponding point here? x is equal to 6 and y is equal to 0. The point become 6 comma 0. Next we have to check whether the solution reason is towards the horizon or away from the horizon. For that purpose, substitute x is equal to 0 and y is equal to 0 in the given inequality. Okay. So put x comma y is equal to 0 comma 0 in what is the inequality here? Minus 50x plus 20y less than minus 300. Substitute margin. All right here. Minus 50 into 0 plus 20 into 0 less than minus 300. Clear? Okay. So minus 50 into 0 nothing but 0 plus 0 less than minus 300 agutta. what about 0 plus 0 this is 0 less than minus 300 so this inequality is false because minus 300 is less than 0 okay so this is here false solution reason is away from origin okay away from the horizon. Clear? In note mark already. So next draw the inequality. Next slide. Next. Okay, load. For the in equation minus 50x plus 20y is equal to minus 300, the corresponding point here is 0, comma minus 50 and 6, comma 0. The solution reason is away from the origin. Okay, now draw the reason of plane, open of plane. So here minus 50 means here it is negative direction of y axis. That is the point on 6, comma 0. 6, comma 0, nothing but this is the point. 6, comma 0, Agutalba. Okay. So now draw the little point 15. I will start from here. So because the inequality is here, strict inequality follow dotted line. So this is nothing but minus 50x plus 20y is equal to minus 300. Okay. So now draw the feasible reason. Oh, sorry, open off plane. Okay. So when a substitute x is equal to zero and y is equal to zero, the inequality is not holds good. That is, inequality become false. That's why the solution reason is away from the origin. So you need know, towards origin agutte. When it is true, when it is false here, away from the origin. So write the arrow mark opposite to the origin. Okay, so now check whether the open off plane determined by the inequality minus 50x plus 20y less than minus 300 have common point with the feasible reason or not known. So when it is drawing this one, this open off plane node. So these are the common point for both feasible reason as well as open off plane determined by the inequality. So so what do we conclude here? Hence this z what is z here objective function has no minimum value because this open off plane have common point with the feasible reason next slide okay, here the open off plane minus 50x plus 20y less than minus 300 has common points with the feasible reason hence z is equal to minus 50x plus 20y has no minimum value okay this is the method find the minimum value you know the minimum value brother because the reason is unbounded so unbounded reason is the gun we have to carry one more step for a minimum take the less than okay so minus 50x plus 20y less than minus 300 okay this is the method so for the both feasible reason as bounded or unbounded in both the cases we have to carry first two steps as it is first one is here find the feasible reason then find the value of the objective function at corner point so after finding that one, so when the reason is bounded, it is not a problem because the largest value become maximum, the least value become minimum value. So when it is unbounded reason, 
ಸೊ ಇನ್ ದ ಕೇಸಲ್ಲಿ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಕ್ಯಾರಿ ಔಟ್ ಒನ್ ಮೋರ್ ಸ್ಟೆಪ್ ಒನ್ ಮೋರ್ ಒನ್ ಸ್ಟೆಪ್ ಜಾಸ್ತಿ ಆಗುತ್ತೆ ಅದೇನಂದರೆ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಡ್ರಾ ದ ಓಪನ್ ಆಫ್ ಫ್ರೆಂಡ್ ಜನರಲಾಗಿ ಹೇಳೋದಾದರೆ ಎ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಬಿ ವೈ ಲೆಸ್ ದ್ಯಾನ್ ಕ್ಯಾಪ್ಟ ಎಮ್ ಆರ್ ಎ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಬಿ ವೈ ಗ್ರೇಟರ್ ದ್ಯಾನ್ ಕ್ಯಾಪ್ಟಲ್ ಎಮ್ ಓಕೆ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ಕೇ